Aiming to further strengthen Sri Lanka's COVID-19 response, Japanese Ambassador to Sri Lanka Mizukoshi Hideaki yesterday presented a stock of essential medical equipment to Health Minister Kahelia Rambukwala in the presence of JICA senior representative Takashi Makiafumi. The provided equipment was procured through JICA's Technical Cooperation Project for Strengthening COVID-19 Response, which was worth 300 million rupees, and includes ventilators, ICU beds, blood gas analyzers, real-time PCR machine, automated RNA, DNA extractor, and ultra-low temperature freezes, which are to be distributed to base hospitals in Teldania, Warakapola, Wallakanda, Pimbura, Nawalapitiya, Hingurik Goda, Karawanela, Avasawala, and District General Hospital, Humbantota. Ambassador Mizukoshi said, This year indeed, is a historic occasion as we celebrate the 70th anniversary of the establishment of diplomatic relations between Japan and Sri Lanka. Well, I'm uh, very happy to be here at the moment of this handover of uh, this equipment concerning uh, COVID. Actually, this is the first uh, ODA project handover ceremony, I think, this year. And uh, this year is um, uh, 70 years anniversary of our diplomatic relationship between Japan and Sri Lanka. Among numerous development assistants of Japan in Sri Lanka, Sri Jayawardenepura General Hospital, which was constructed with Japan's assistance in 1983, stands in forefront as the symbol of the great friendship between Japan and Sri Lanka in the field of health. Firstly, let me thank government of Japan, who have been extremely generous with Sri Lanka all the years that I can remember. I think uh, Japan has been our best friend in terms of assistance, in terms of commerce, economics, and also the cultural friendship and the mutual friendship we have been nurtured over a period of time. Apart from that, if you look at our infrastructure development fund, which is an annual fund which we have been working for the last 30 years, 60% of that annual fund has been always, you all have been generous enough to accommodate that. For more latest news, subscribe to FTTV.